What's going on guys? This is Danny Summers with Intercept MMA. Thank you guys for tuning in. If you guys can, please hit like and subscribe. Also hit the notification bell. That way anytime we're putting out new videos, new content, new fight breakdowns, you guys can see it first. All right, so now we're gonna be getting into is off the lead low kick pulling for the opposite lead. Um, this one is good, especially when we're not really sure what to do after that lead low kick. And we don't wanna put ourselves in limbo right in front of somebody where we're on one foot in the pocket, especially if they're not moving back. So if me and Anna are in front of each other, what I'm gonna be looking to do right now is just give her like a good strong lead leg that she can push off of. And I'm just gonna pretend like I'm in a strong stance here. Now Anna can do this off a jab inside, that way she's still threatening upstairs to get my hands up. But now once she fires that kick, she's gonna pull off that kick and get right back into the opposite lead. So if I'm just kinda of hanging out here in my stance, she fires that kick and pulls. And notice when she pulls, her weapons are still pointed right at me. So again, I should have to turn and face her because from here I'm not in a position where I'm not going to throw anything significant. Even if I try to bring this kick up, she'll probably either A, be on me, or B, she'll be able to defend and counter right off the get-go. So again, if she's in front of me, the feet are what's doing it. So if you guys notice, once she throws that kick, she's pushing off her rear foot, but she's also throwing her head and her foot in this direction. So after she fires that kick, Boom, she pushes and fires. Notice the head goes over the rear foot because now she's getting the head away from me. Okay, if she just kind of left her head in that same position and just kind of pulled, it's very easy for me to counter there. So she brings her head with her. So again, from this angle, she fires, pulls. And now you guys can have any kind of follow-up you guys want. Most of the time it's gonna be that rear hand. So again, if we're in this, this position here, same thing applies. When she fires that combination, she pulls. And now if you guys wanna put this into a drill, if Anna's back in front of me, as a feeder, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look to hit her with a cross every time she kicks my, so once I feel her kick my leg, I'm putting a do, uh, two right down the pipe. So she fires that, boom, I'm pu putting that cross right down the center line. That's gonna let her know she's off that line. So again, boom. And again, from here, if this was live and I missed, you guys can see where that counter would be, okay? So this is a good way to pull the opposite lead off a lead low kick. Yes, we can do this off a body kick, probably off a head kick as well, but the lead low kick, our feet are closer to the mat, so we're gonna get there a little bit quicker than normal and get us into that next position where we can start to follow up from the opposite lead. Give it a try. <laughs> 